Andres, I can only imagine that the Beloso family and all of St. Bernard were just so thrilled when Cade hit that home run last night. Look, I'm sure the LSU fans over there in Omaha really kept the stadium rocking, but uh, that's for sure what happened here at St. Bernard, including at places like the old Araby Bar. People were just pressed up against the screen when that big play happened. Again, I spoke with a lot of people in the community about his impact, not only while he was playing here, but as he's played all the way on to the World Series. The party over in Omaha looks a bit like this. All thanks to Rodney Beloso, the father of LSU designated hitter Cade Beloso. Every day I walk into the stadium, you know, I'm a fan first and just my son happens to play there. So uh, it's a win-win for me. The proud dad is feeling good ahead of the win or go home game against Wake Forest, especially after his son's three-run homer in the last game to keep the Tigers' national championship hopes alive. It's a move that he did not too long ago during his time at John Curtis, helping his team win a state championship. He's been in some fortunate situations that he's had the opportunity to help his team win um, and, and just happened to be more than one occasion. He had trouble last year with injuries. He didn't get the chance to play in the regionals. And now he has the opportunity to play in the World Series and hit a home run. It's great. The parish is so proud of him. Now back home in St. Bernard Parish, the community has been rallying behind the homegrown star. He was the prep baseball player of the year, Louisiana Gatorade player of the year, outstanding achievements. He's, he's really a good kid. They're showing love for Beloso and the rest of the Tigers on their road to a national championship. It's a wave of uh, purple and gold going into the stadium. Rodney Beloso really hopeful that his son and the LSU Tigers get that win tonight. And that only signifies, you know, a chance at a World Series title, but it also means that they can continue their Louisiana tailgates over there outside the stadium. Game starts at 6 o'clock tonight. But for now, reporting live here in St. Bernard Parish, Andres Fuentes, Fox State. Local